today you had a very difficult challenge because you had to fill in for uh, Jerome Lebanner. Yes. And um, well, it didn't it didn't go as you as you ha would have wished. But uh, what would you say about your opponent after the fight? My opponent was a strong guy. Uh, I think it was a good fight. I didn't train. They called me Wednesday. They confirmed the fight on uh, Tuesday. Uh, I was in the plane for Friday, and now I'm standing in. So I didn't train. I didn't do nothing. I think I show good heart. I think my uh, my opponent did uh, did did the best he could. I I, I think he didn't uh, thought that it uh, that it uh, would uh, be that difficult because I didn't train. But still, I was here. I give the people a good show. I think I, I fight for 50 minutes hard. The first round went good. The second round. Uh, uh, was was uh, less because uh, uh, I was a little bit tired. I feel I feel the uh, the um, I've, I feel the power fade away. And then the third round, I did my best again to uh, to uh, to uh, uh, give a good fight. So he he won fair and square. Still, I think if I had the proper uh, if I had the prop if I had the proper preparation that I would win the fight, but that is not important now. The important thing is that the people of KSW, has an, uh, uh, they, uh, they uh, see a good fight, they have a good evening, so I'm, uh, fair, I'm very satisfied. I, I couldn't do more than now. So uh, if they were to offer you a rematch against uh, Martin Rozalski, you would definitely accept it? Uh, I'm not the guy who likes rematches, I'm the guy who just want to come and fight. But if they offer me a fight, what is the case? Because I will come back again. Uh, they already promised me that. Uh, then, uh, then, uh, then I have the proper training. Then I show a different fighter. Because today I, f I, f I fought the mentality because I didn't train. I didn't do MMA for three years. So, uh, you know, I, I came today. I just fight on instinct. I, I, I fight. I fight on experience, and I fought a tough fighter. So. Uh, it, is, it is no shame in this loss. Uh, when it comes to an opponent, a future opponent in KSW, if you had to choose um, anyone from the locker room uh, that, that you have seen today in action, who would it be? Uh, I have to be honest that I didn't see shit. Because <laughs> I was in the locker room all night and, uh, and, uh, and I came here just, just, just in my own fight. But if I have... Uh, if I have choice, I want to stand up fight because uh, the, the, the most important thing is that the people have an enjoyable fight, you know. And uh, the, the people who know me, I don't like the guys who are wrestling all night, lay and pray. I just want to bang it out and I showed that today. I wasn't that sharp, but still I give the people a good fight. So if I come back, I want to stand up fight and I think that I can show the people the best of my skills then. So, but I don't uh, prefer a name. I just want a good stand-up fighter who I can match with. Thank you very much. No problem. I just want to say something. Mm -hmm. I have my son with me as coach. He is 18 years old. Give him one year, two years, and he will be the next KSW champion. That is that's a promise. Okay. Yes. Thank don't you very much. don't forget the name. Eh? Put it in the TV or what you're doing. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> okay, so good luck to both you no and yourself. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>